Hello guys, today I am in Umal Queen Zoo and today I am going to show you all the animals in the zoo. So let's go! And this is the full view of the zoo of Umal Queen. Here is the rest area. This is a hall, sitting area. Inside the zoo. Oh. Beautiful. This is sitting area. And there is. Huh? There is a gym. There is a gym in the zoo. That is a surprise. Though it's very hot here. Inside gym, there was one. This is the grand view of the zoo. All the cages on the side. This one is for the puppies actually. And they have a lot of puppies in this cage. I don't know why. So I will just go to the other side and see if we see any more lions and tigers. Oh, I haven't seen tiger yet. So let's go and find out where the tiger is. We need at least two. And here is the other one. And the tiger is here. It's sitting in the open. Uh, hey, boy. How, are you? How close can we get to it? It's chain. Ah, it's chain. Ah. The tiger is in open. But if, huh? if I buy a ticket, I, I don't want to go inside. <laughs> He's saying if you buy a ticket, you can go inside. Why would I want to <laughs> go near to that? This is the tiger. I find, finally found that there are two tigers in the zoo. Although I'll be free after half hour. This one is gonna stay here. And Abdul is also here. Abdul? He came here and he didn't even say hi. What a fucking ungrateful friend he is another couple oh this looks like a lazy lion this lion is so fat it reminds me of Nawaz Sharif lion and there's also up here I think it's because it's very hot they are sitting in the in the water pond and on the other side there are ostriches they, they look like they're baby ostriches they're not very big hello buddy where are you going come here talk to me hey, you scared you shit Little shit, come here, talk to me. There's a white tiger, and he does not look very good. I think it's because of the heat. Ah, this is a pair. You see the one inside? Focus on the door. There's a one that's sitting inside, staring at me. And this is the other one. Hello, buddy. It's very, very cool that we just confine them into the small cages for our amusement they should be out in open living the mighty life they're supposed to live because God made these glorious creature to roar and run and attack and hunt and show the world what strength is what domination is not to suffer in this in the confinement like this the third cage for the lion this is white tigress and she looks miserable like whoa it's because either because she is depressed for being in the cage or she hasn't had proper food or maybe just because we are right in the middle of a desert and the tiger and the lions they don't like to live here they like to live in their natural habitat another one of the lions and these ones are just as miserable as the other one. Here they came, 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 they came,
and I don't know what happened to them, but um, they must have gotten some really spanky. Look at the bears here. This one also wow, looks very miserable. Imagine if they were out and open, he would eat me like a chopstick. But now he's just looking at me very helplessly. I think he needs help. Of course they need help, they're in cage. They want to break free. Hello buddy, how you doing? Now we have seen two bears and they're grizzly bear. Most formidable animal on the planet. The strongest animal on the planet, but look at him. How freaking miserable he is right now. See, if you were confined in a cage for the rest of your life, of course you'd be miserable too. So this is just very, very inhuman on our part to to find amusement in such cruelty. Allah. Another pair of bears. One is lying flat on the ground and the other one is yawning. Uh, a very small door. Uh, here we got the alligator. But it's a crocodile, I don't know. How you doing, buddy? And there's many more actually, if you can focus on the water. You will see some eyes and some noses outside. Hmm? It's them. They are very, very dangerous. Hmm? So, see you later, alligator. The one is coming out. Hello, alligator. Ah, the other one is already out. Okay. Right at the center of the zoo, there is this. It's still elephant, they don't have the real one I guess, so they just built one of their own, huh? <laughs> Here, this is a small sanctuary within the forest and this one is quite beautiful, see? They have this uh, a small lake, very small, kind of a pound. And there are fishes, so many of them. And there is a animal show going on. Okay. You see there is a parrot sitting in between these trees. I'm just trying to get a closer look. Here, see, hello buddy. And these, these birds are free. See? And they are in open. Yeah. Here, these are the birds. And we have the tortoise. You see, the only one is moving. The rest are very calm, just like Pakistani population they do nothing they're sitting there no matter what happens to them and enjoying their moment huh? raccoon oh they have unusually long tail and this is the only pair of lion that's eating. They look alive. The rest of them look very, very miserable. Hello, buddy. If my baby kaya hai, to kalula kara. And this one. Yeah, they move the shape. This majestic black panther. This looks so beautiful. You cannot even spot it in the darkness. And there's another panther. 
हमारे पास एंड वी का द ब्लैक पेंथर हेलो बड़ी आउ यस दिस इज द ब्लैक पेंथर एंड द अदर वन इज इनसाइड देयर Yep. And this is the last cage of the lions. And also here we have black panther, but it's hiding away. You can see one here. Hala, and the tigers are done. There's only one that's in the open, and these guys are sitting with this one. They asked me if I wanted to come in. and hell nobody <laughs> i don't want to come in and look at what we have here these monkeys are hanging from their tail i'm not sure what they're called and there are no sign boards or any writings about it but look at them all of them they are hanging from their tails and it's something interesting huh and these are vultures hey you know some of our politicians are called vultures too uh, they are famous for eating that cock so that's why they are called vulture hey vulture what's up buddy some of your you know community members are in pakistan they are running the country uh, yeah say hi to them ye dekhiye mile hain hum baboon finally i got to see one and i don't know what happened to them but Mm. They must have gotten some really funky. Look at the bears here. This one also wow, looks very miserable. Imagine if they were out and open, he would eat me like a chopstick. But now he's just looking at me very helplessly. I think he needs help. Of course, they need help. They're in cage. They want to break free. Hello, buddy. How you doing? Here we have some gooses or their swine. I'm not very sure. There's a small lake, and I found Gani. Hello, hello, little monkey. Ah, he's alone. That's why he seems to be very pissed. Bro, you don't have any company. I have a friend in Pakistan. His name is Gani. He's coming to see me the next month, so I'll bring him. Okay, then both of you can hang out. What's up, little buddy? I hate when I see you animals in cage. I don't like it one bit. They are they should be up free. Should be in the in the jungle, living their best life. This is the other one. Oh my God! So there are two monkeys, and they both are in separate cages. That I do not understand what the philosophy behind it, but it seems very cool. Hello, monkey. Hey, buddy. And there is a cage of baby. Oh, they are very small. All of them are the yeah, the same size. You can see the family is back there. These ones have very nice house, tree house kind of thing going on inside. And they are making love. पकड़े गए अब करना चुम्मी <laughs> अरे भाई जान अरे भाई साहब तो इंटर के अच्छा पक्के प्यार कर रहा है अरे भाई साहब अरे भाई साहब अरे बस भैया अरे सच्चा प्यार करता था आशे तूने टुकराया है अब टुकरा के वो देखो जहा के हाथ चला रहा <laughs> टुकरा के उसका प्यार का हेलो बड़ी आदे हंगी
Look at this one. It's so desperate to get out. We've <laughs> got a more of them. Look at This one also. See? Oh. Wow. They are not willing to stick behind now. They're fighting. At least someone fights. And finally a leopard. This one looks still sharp. Oh. It looks in much better shape than the rest of the lions. I think this one is new here or maybe it's just surviving better. Hello monkeys. Hey buddy. And there is a cage of baby. Oh, they're very small. All of them are at the, at the same size. You can see the family is back there. These ones have very nice house, tree house kind of thing going on inside. And they're making love. अब टुकरा के वो देखो जहाँ के हाथ चला रहा टुकरा के उसका प्यार here we have some gooses or their swine. I'm not very sure. There's a small lake. And I found Ghani. Hello. Hello, little monkey. Ah, he's alone. That's why he seems to be very good. Bro, you don't have any company? I have a friend in Pakistan. His name is Ghani. He's coming to see me. The next one, so I'll bring him, okay? Then both of you can hang out. What's up, little buddy? I hate when I see the animals in the I don't like it one bit. They are, they should be oh, free, should be in the, in the jungle, living their best life. And look at what we have here. These monkeys are hanging from their tail. I'm not sure what they're called and there are no fine boards or any writings about it but look at them, all of them, they're hanging from their tails. Maybe something interesting, huh? And these are vultures. Hey! You know some of our politicians are called vultures too. Uh, they're famous for eating dead corpses, so that's why they're called vultures. Hey vulture, what's up buddy? Some of your, you know, community members are in Pakistan, they're running the country. Uh, yeah, say hi to them. This is the other one. Oh my god. So there are two monkeys and they both are in separate cages. That I do not understand what the philosophy behind it, but it seems very cool. I just finished my tour of the zoo. I saw all the animals, everything. A very beautiful animal. Too many animals, the zoo is very well maintained. But at the end of the tour, I'm having a moral dilemma. The moral dilemma is, why do we need zoo? Because all these majestic animals, the lions, the bears, tigers, the black panthers, they have so many beautiful animals. But they are all living in a small cage. They look miserable because the beauty and the, and the, and the grace of creation, when you see them in their natural habitat, habitat you will see the lions roaring, you will see the tiger attacking other animals. That's the beauty of their strength, their spirit. You will see the God creation in them. Here you will see them as miserable toys. So again, the question I'm asking, why do we need zoo? Is it not bad enough that we kill animals for our need, for our food? Do we have to torture them for our amusement? They deserve to live in the free sanctuary in the natural habitat. Only then we will see and we will be able to appreciate and understand the beauty of creation. Right now, this creation is a miserable. I 
do not support the idea of Zeus at all.